Hi everyone. Welcome to Life Cycle Assessment of Vehicle Tires. What is Life Cycle Assessment? Life Cycle Assessment is cradle-to-grave or cradle-to-cradle -cradle analysis technique to assess environmental impacts associated with all the stages of a product's life, which is from raw material extraction through materials processing, manufacture, distribution, and use. Did you know about some interesting facts about vehicle tires? Let's find out together. 1 billion of vehicle tires were produced in the world each year over 450 factories. There are 200 different raw materials used to make one vehicle tire. Passenger car tires generally need to be replaced over 500 miles of usage. It contains 68.5% of rubber, 16.5% steel, 5.5% and 9.5% residuals. Four largest tire company make more than 75% revenue. In 1960 Goodyear has developed an illuminated tire with a transparent rubber with lights mounted on the inner rim. However, these tires ended up being only a prototype because the rubber was too expensive. On the other hand, Michelin has working on developing airless tire that will never go flat which actually a wheel and tire all in one. The tires is made from organic and recyclable materials. Top 5 of tire manufacturers company in the world are Bridgestone, Michelin, Goodyear, Continental and Sumitomo tires. Let's move to history of vehicle tires. In 1888, gasoline cars and pneumatic tires were first invented by Benz. In 1905, tread tire were developed using thick rubber to protect carcass and breaker. In 1923, tread tire with low pressure tire were invented to increase contact area to road surface. Then, radial tire were invented on 1947. Run flat tire were developed in 1970 to enable vehicle to continue to be driven up to 80 km per hour without replacing with new tire when punctured. Ultra high performance tire also developed in 1980 to boast superior cornering, drivability and braking. In 2000, eco tuning tires which tires that increase fuel saving and protect environment were developed. In 2012, non pneumatic tire were developed by hand cooked tire were airless tire using new type of materials and help save energy by reducing production process. Life cycle assessment of vehicle tire include entire life cycle of product. It is also takes account numerous activities. Production phase where production of raw materials, their transport to production section, production of tires and packaging occur. In distribution phase, it involves transport of final product and installation process on the car. Next is usage while using process scenarios and process such as maintenance or cleaning the tires happen. Then, worn tires were collected in phase 4. Final process include different end of life scenarios include recycling, recover, reuse or landfill of worn tires. In production phase, 11.7% energy were used. In tire distribution, less than 1% energy were used. 86% of energy were used in use phase of tire vehicles. Tire collecting phase used less than 1% of energy. In the final process phase, energy used is about 2%. Let's discuss about the impact of vehicle tires phase life cycle. Production cause continued deforestation to climate harming fossil fuels used to make synthetic rubber to the assembly process. Tire distribution also cause waste generation whether in solid or liquid form. The use of tires throw off tiny plastic polymers that end up as pollutant in ocean and waterways. Unrecycled or burned tires end up in landfill can cause problems. 
burning tires for energy cause pollution where contain high levels of potential pollutants such as zinc and chlorine. Two hundred ninety million of vehicle tires discarded in U.S. each year. Vehicle tires take 50 to 80 years to decompose in landfill. Whole tires take up a lot of space in landfill which about 75% of landfill. Landfill liners damaged by tires can cause soil and water contamination. Recyclable tires can become Ballistic backdrops Gym floor mats Synthetic turf Playground cover Soil additives Running tracks Vehicle tires have been invented in the past and have received various changes to improve the quality and duration of use. The life cycle of vehicle tires can be understand and the every phase that involve in vehicle life cycle is really important to study. The impact of vehicle tires life cycle is important to study where it can help to establish the benchmark against which improvements can be measured. Life Cycle Assessment LCA, is important in new product research and development, when environmental footprint is important to the future marketing or cost structure of a product.